we have created the sales order and issued the delivery. We now need to also raise the invoice so that the customer can pay us. In the next step, let's create the invoice for the customer. Before we do this, let us first review what we have done so far. The sales order we have originally created, number 850, is in the meanwhile close, which means there are no more open items to be delivered. We can now right-click anywhere on the document to see the relationship map. The relationship map shows us that a delivery has already been created, number 1048, which currently is still open. If I click on the delivery box in the relationship map, I can see the details of delivery. I can now see the items and the quantities that have been delivered, and can see that the delivery is still open, which means it has not been invoiced yet. So all I need to do is to copy this delivery to an invoice. Again, I get a warning that this customer has exceeded his credit limit. In this case, I will ignore the warning and continue with my transactions. The system now copies all information into an AR invoice, including the reference to the previous documents. I can again have a look at the journal entry preview to see the accounting impact of this transaction, and I can see that my customer maxi tag will be debited, while my domestic sales revenue will be credited. I also can preview the actual invoice to the customer that will be created before I save the document. I am happy with the document and click on Add to save the invoice.